This writing seems to be pointing to something nearby. over completely. They get the radio tower repaired? Not yet. I don't think any of the techs thought they'd be repairing their 50-year-old comlink. Well, they better figure it out. You're new with Trinity, right? First contract. Uh, made some bounce for him. Incoming! We're under attack! Stop! You're dead! side here. I've been working as a maintenance tech for Trinity out here, but I've got to get out of here. These people are insane. I've been stockpiling gear. It's yours, if you can pay for it. They won't notice a few missing items, but if they catch wind, or if they see me with you, I'm a dead man. I'll need some untraceable currency in case things go south. Gold, preferably. You think we can make a deal? I'll see what I can dig up. It's not nukes. Creepy-looking guy with a scarred face named Constantine gave us a big speech, talked about destiny and something called the Source. And frankly, I'm even more baffled. The other contractors seem to be just as antsy and nervous as I am. But the company men, the guys who've been with Trinity for a long time, they're drinking it up and asking for seconds. It's fucking Jonestown out here. We're preparing for an assault. Against who, you might ask? I mean, there's people here, like natives lost in time we're talking furs skins and iron arrowheads we're about to go meet them with attack choppers and 50 cal machine guns i'm on the wrong goddamn side of history Soviet propaganda.
and concerned. We've had trouble with the natives. Our communications were offline, but everything is now under control. If the situation becomes untenable, we will step in. It won't. You sent me for a reason. I was chosen for this. I will succeed. See that you do. Hey! <gasps> Are you okay? Oh, thank God. Anna. What? What are you doing here? I don't know. I can't remember. What's happening, Lara? I'm scared. I'm so sorry. I didn't think they'd come after you. This is all my fault. Who? Who are they? What did they want? The same thing my father was after. Oh no, Laura. I told you not to do this. Whatever they want, just give it to them. It's not that simple. Just hold on. I'll get us out of here. Somehow. doesn't know. What? You... No. You're with them! I can't believe this. You... You... Come on! You couldn't let it go, could you? I knew you'd find your way to this place. What did you expect? It doesn't have to be this way. We seek the same thing. We could use someone like you. You want a purpose in your life? We can provide that. You've got to be kidding. I've seen how Trinity operates. Is that a no? It's a no fucking way! Tell me, Anna. Were you recruited by Trinity before or after you started screwing my father? I loved Richard. But he was blinded by idealism. And it destroyed him. What would you do with the artifact? Show it to the world. Redeem your father's good name. You're still so naive. Just a frightened little girl trying to walk in her daddy's shoes. We're done here. No. Not yet. You and I... We can still be on the same side of history. Think about it, Laura.
This isn't over. Bastard! Perhaps that's all he knows how to be. I thought I was alone. So did I, but here we are. So what should I call my new acquaintance? Nothing. I won't be staying. Constantine has little patience. Nor do I. So I see. Nice trick. Can you get us out of here? There's no us. I don't even know who you are or why you're here. Sorry. I'm not feeling particularly trusting right now. You won't get far without me. <laughs> you don't know how far I've come. What do you know about them? A sect. Ancient and secretive. They believe themselves to be doing the work of God. From what I've seen, they're pretty far from holy. And what do you plan to do with that? I'll let you know when I think of it. They have heard that. All the more reason to get out of here. Is there a way out? No, but I found something that might be useful. Careful. We don't want to attract attention. Get out! Wait! Let me out! I can help you. I can't trust you. We may not be enemies. I can see that. I suspect you do too. I work better alone. I know the layout. I know the land. I'm a fast learner. I'm no doubt of that. Maybe I can offer you something more valuable. I know what you're all after. Lara, take this, in case we get separated. We have to move. The guards will be coming through on rounds any moment. Do you know the way out? Yes. I've had some time to study this place. We began invasion of the valley not 24 hours ago. I expected resistance and have not been disappointed. The people of the valley think they defeat us, but the harder they fight, the stronger my resolve grows. If they weren't protecting something, they wouldn't martyr themselves so. They wouldn't endure tortures with such resolve. They are believers. I respect that. But they are on the wrong side of this battle. It will not be long now. A new, better world is at hand. A silver cigarette case. 
Looks like it's been through a war, which is likely. How long were you in that cell? Long enough to learn that Constantine won't stop until he's found what he's looking for. The Divine Source. Is it here? <laughs> Trust must go both ways, Lara. What is this? A history lesson. This place has its own scars. It was a work camp. I finally laid my betrayals bare. Lara knows the truth. Now a strange series of emotions has gripped me. Remorse, certainly. Remorse for a piece of me that was left inside that torture cell. But something else, too. I know Constantine thinks that I've lost my edge, that my time with the Crofts has made me soft, but he's wrong. It isn't softness. It feels instead like a new kind of resolve. I knew Lord Croft to be an intelligent man. I know his daughter holds secrets in her head. As an ally, she'd be invaluable. As an enemy, she'll be a difficult problem. I must make sure that Constantine's arrogance doesn't get the better of him as we take her on. The Soviets sent prisoners here to work in the mines. Even that was the they captured them, took children from their mothers to work as slaves. God, it must have been horrible. Anyone who survived those days has stories to tell. That doesn't look like mining. It looks like an excavation. It's, uh, possible. They dug anywhere they caught a hint of wealth. Those... those are ancient. What did they find? You'll have to ask them. We have to go. We aren't safe here. Copper mill before the storm sets in. Thank <laughs> you. 
I see her. Take her down. I'm on. Anna has let the mask fall. She and I are finally fully reunited. It has been difficult without her these past years. When I'm weak, it's always been her voice that gave me strength. When she loses hope, I ignite that hope for her. That being said, I must confess that I am worried about her. Her health falters, yes, but my concern is with her resolve. I fear that some piece of her was lost in her time with the Crofts. She must have faked her emotions for Lord Croft so powerfully they became real. And now I feel that fear has spilled over to Laura. Jacob, I found a way to open the inner gate. Head to the courtyard. I'm already inside.
here, here, and here. What about Anna? I need to get in there. Do it. We have a lot of ground to cover, and Trinity wants the artifact found as soon as possible. We aren't getting anything on satellite. Too much interference. Constant cloud cover. It's as if this place doesn't exist. It wasn't supposed to. If this is truly where the Jacob, is divided, what is he doing? This is the place. I can feel it. The Shit. Are quite convinced. Be careful, Lara. But I want to get into those rooms myself. And Croft. We keep her alive. I cannot wait to leave this frozen hell. Then I have good news. Reconnaissance from the scouts. The natives have a settlement on the other side of the mountain. Soon, you will have your day. We both will. Just as long as you don't lose focus again. What do you mean? You're sentimental about her. The Croft girl, I can tell because she's still alive. We can't afford to dwell in the past. You doubt me? You know what I've given to Trinity, what I've sacrificed, what I face! <coughs> I'm fine. Life has not been kind to either of us, but I swore I'd always protect you. Now who's being sentimental? I promise you, all of this will be worth it in the end with the Divine Source you will live, but more importantly, you will live in a world cleansed of sin. Send your men to this settlement. Find out what they know. It's too dangerous. Let me have my pleasures. None of this will matter. The day our work is accomplished. Constantine, you're needed in the holding cells. We're in this together, sister. Remember. Always. What are you doing? Mankind shall be judged. The non-believers turned to ash and swept away. And the pure of faith will be raised up and given life eternal. Get out! I'll find you! You've got to find them! Keep looking! They have to be here somewhere in the woods. I don't Alright. I've got to find a way out of here. on the north end of the Gulag. I'll wait for you there. On my way. We need assistance. The control room door is locked from inside. We're gonna have to break it down. Damn. Got to get out of here. Strange being in the field again. I was undercover for so long, locked in a life of comfort at Croft Manor. Here, there is no comfort at all. The air is frozen, the food is canned and cold. The company, aside from Constantine, is abysmal. But I ask to be here. I need to be here. I do not have the luxury of time or patience. Constantine and I begin this journey together. I will be there when he fulfills his destiny. So for now, I'll breathe deep. I'll let the cold air burn my lungs. I'll let it remind me that I'm still alive and let it fuel me for the final push towards our destiny. Tear this place apart!
A military patch for Trinity soldiers. Aside from the design, there's no identifying techs. They keep themselves hidden, even from their own foot soldiers. As we push deeper into the valley, I find myself staring at the ruins and pondering my own mortality. 
These structures have been here for ages, waiting for this moment. I can feel their anticipation. The stone itself wants us to succeed. And what is there to stop us? Non-believers, the fearful, and the lost. Those that hid the source from Trinity for so long. We are the very people who would use what's hidden here as it was intended to be used. This world is too corrupt, too rotten, too sick to be saved by any means other than Trinity. We will have our army. A righteous man will lead it. Constantine will be that man. into some trouble. first time in weeks, things are becoming clear. I know, there's something hidden here. The Soviets came looking for it too, and now Trinity and Anna. Anna. God, I still don't quite believe it. All this time, did she watch Dad as well? I've got to keep moving. Find Jacob and join his people. If I can prove myself to them, maybe he will tell me more about this place. Ah! <laughs> 
As we push deeper into the valley, I feel reassured that this is the work I was chosen to perform. My stigmata itch with sensation. It is a constant reminder of my higher purpose, of my singular position in this higher purpose. I was a child, innocent to the evils of the world. Then, one night, I woke in such pain, a scream on my lips. Blood dripped from my palms when I saw it. I was terrified. It marked me. It meant something. I cannot shirk this mission any more than I can shirk my own hands. Jacob? I think I'm close to the train yard. Are you there? Another Soviet plaque. Enemies must answer for their crimes. Hmm, bit grim. So long. I thought I lost you back there. Not a chance. Thanks for getting me out of that place. Let's move! 
Take it easy. Drink this. It'll help. You could have left me in that river. Would you have left me? I'd have thought about it. <laughs> what makes you think I didn't? What makes you risk so much to come here? A divine source. I know what you're looking for. But I want to know why. When I was young, it was just my father and I. He was an archaeologist, too. In his last years, he was... obsessed with myths about immortality. Of course, no one believed him. Including me. Our last conversation... was a fight he... He took his own life. I thought I'd come to terms with it, but... Something else happened. And I saw something that I thought was impossible. It changed everything. I 
realized my father was right. He died alone and broken. But he died for something. So you believe the divine source is real? I honestly don't know. But if there is any truth to it, I have to find out. It, it needs to be researched and studied. It could make a difference to the world. It's not something to be hidden away. A difference is not always for the best. Would you wish Trinity to have the secret to immortality? Of course not. Then I would ask you not to abandon your quest, but to alter its path. Join me and my people. Help us repel Constantine and Trinity. Then after that's done. And you leave our valley untouched. But knowing that you've done the right thing. No. I'm sorry. I can't do that. Can't? Or won't? I'll fight Trinity with you, but my goal remains the same. If I give up now... You'd feel like you'd be letting him down. Not just him. I need answers, Jacob. I need to understand. You're leaving. Right now, my concern is for my village. It's over the mountain pass. A day's journey on foot. But there may be a faster way through the old copper mine. You rest. I'll be back soon. Jacob, are you there? Damn it. Where is he? with the native in the old sawmill. We wounded her, but it looks like they set traps around the perimeter. I've got one casualty so far. Doing a sweep. Alone again. Jacob's gone ahead. There's something about him that I can't quite put my finger on. It's strange, but almost comforting. Like I could tell him anything, and it wouldn't faze him. I sense no judgment from him, yet at the same time, he's hard to read. My instincts tell me he's a good man. He saved my life. I think I can trust him, at least for now. But I can't shake a nagging feeling that he knows more than he's letting on. 